common question I get asked quite a bit is, do our pedals sound better with a Vox style amp or with a Fender style amp? So for this video, I wanted to kind of demonstrate uh, our, a few basic overdrives, like the basic bread and butter groups. The Tube Screamer, a Klon bass circuit, which is our Tumnus, it's based on a Klon type of thing. And then the Euphoria, which is, uh, it's not really based on anything, but it's more of a transparent flat EQ sort of overdrive. A little bit of sparkle. So first of all, I got an AC15. I'm on the top boost channel. Here's my clean tone on that. I have the gains cranked completely on these overdrives right now. I have I've tried to set volume to Unity pretty much. So here's the Tube Screamer, first of all. From there, let's go to the Tumnus. So that's with the amp set really clean. It's pretty sparkly, pretty chimey, pretty clean. So let's turn that channel, well, let's turn it all the way up. I want to back the bass off just a bit because it gets a little bit flubby if you don't. Um, and let's get a good dirty sound just from the amp alone, no pedals. Now one thing you can do, but I don't really like the sound of it that much, is keep the same settings going into a cranked amp, and it tends to get kind of fuzzy, and which can be good, but not really what most people intend for an overdriven tone. So let's start with the Tube Screamer that way. <laughs> And then with the Tumnus. And then with the Euphoria. Again, it's not that it's a bad tone. Uh, me personally, if I'm going into a dirty amp, I'm going to back the gain down quite a bit to about nine o'clock or so generally. And I'm gonna crank the level up. I'm gonna do that all the way across and then run it that way. But of course that does depend on what type of tone I'm going for. So when we do it that way, here's what the Tube Screamer sounds like through that dirty amp, that dirty AC-15. to the Tumnus. And the U4. 
for you. So there really is no right or wrong answer here. If you like the gain all the way up on the pedal, run into the dirty, into the dirty amp that way. That's totally fine. Uh, again, I'm, I'm kind of using the flavor of the mid mid characteristics and then hitting the front the front end of that amp a little harder. So that's why I'm rolling the gain back uh, quite a bit and just hitting it with volume, with that mid-range focused volume. So, and on a Tube Screamer, um, you, and you can kind of hear it, the mids are quite a bit different than they are on the Tumnus or, or a Klon based circuit, where uh, a Klon based circuit is more around 1K and a, a TS9 or TS808, it's more around 720 hertz or so. So it's a, it's a little bit lower in the mid range register. All right, so let's go to the deluxe reverb and do the same thing and uh, see what kind of tones we're getting there in comparison to the AC15. My clean tone here on the deluxe reverb, um, we're about four and a half on the volume. Here's the deluxe reverb. Again, let's start out with the gains all the way up and volumes to unity. Here's the Tube Screamer. Tumnus. Let's go on over to the Euphoria. And of course, let's crank up the volume on the Deluxe Reverb so we can hear how fantastic it sounds when it's cranked. All right, so let's repeat the same test that we did on the Vox where we have the gain up and go into the Crank Deluxe Reverb. Here's the Tube Screamer. Let's go to Tumnus. Thank you. 
And of course, Euphoria. So that is definitely one way to run your dirt pedals into an already cranked amp. I myself, like I said, I like to turn the gains down a bit, so I'm flavoring that particular amp with the sound of the pedal. So again, with the with the tube skimmer being more mid-rangey as well as the tumness, sometimes it actually helps an, an amp that's a little flubby on the bottom end tighten up. So let's simulate that. First, the tube skimmer. Tumnus. Then Euphoria. So I hope the video helped you. Uh, make sure you click subscribe. If you're not subscribed, click the little bell to get notifications whenever I make new videos. And uh, thanks for watching. See you next week with a new one.